with the Rajya Sabha adjourned senior day without placing the contentious Citizenship Amendment Bill 2016, curfew imposed in the two districts of Imphal has been relaxed and conglomerate of civil society organizations Manpac and PAM call off the agitations. Normalcy seems to have returned and police personnel who have been deployed in the streets since the last two days return back to their stations. Meanwhile, women folk came out to celebrate its victory at Imakai Thil, led by Manipur Peoples Against Citizenship Amendment Bill 2016. Addressing the mass, Yumnamcha Dilip Kumar, convener of Manpac, said, The victory was only possible because of the mass support and constant protests taken out by the women vendors of Khairamban Kaithil and all the people of the region. Dilip Kumar also said that union government could not table the cap due to the mass movement of the people of the entire Northeast region. However, said that even as the intensified protests will be suspended, democratic form of protests will continue to find out the motive behind the reason for trying to amend the citizenship bill and mention that they will make sure that this bill is not introduced again. However, whatever damage to the property and individual should be compensated by the government, he said. Condemning the police access to women protester at Khairamban Kaithil on February 10th, injuring seven women, Dilukumar said the treatment cost of those injured should be borne by the government. <laughs> On the other hand, Dilip Kumar further added that as the people of the state felt insecure to the identity and culture as well as the land, the government should urge the center to give presidential assent to the Manipur People's Bill, which was passed by the Manipur State Assembly. He also said that Manpac will also urge the government for updating of NRC as done in Assam. All parties under Manpac and women folk was flooded at Imakai Thil to celebrate its parcel victory. During the celebration, they also shout slogans like Long Live Manipur, No to Cap. Meanwhile, both Menpak and Pam, which have been spearheading the mass agitation, seems to be not completely calm with the lapse of the bill as it was not tabled at the Rajya Sabha. Both the bodies express apprehension that the government of India may use some other technique to introduce similar act. With Tarosha, APN Info.